Hi guys and welcome to the channel. So today I have an art journaling video for you. Now I don't tend to put up a lot of art journaling videos because I don't think they're very popular but I've come to the realization today that um well that shouldn't matter. <laughs> And what it is, is um, art journaling is my first love. It really is. I spend more time art journaling than I do anything else. And um, I tend to not put as many videos up because, well, that's what I do. I, I art journal and I worry that they're not very popular. They're not getting many likes, but I figure that shouldn't matter. <laughs> so it's, you know, my channel, like-minded people will find it if they're interested. And if they're not, they might just find something else. So I think I really need to just, you know, put more pic more videos up of what I enjoy creating. And this happens to be one of them. <clears throat> so this is a video in my, um, a, a page in my 100, 100 day project art journal. So if you haven't heard of the 100 day project, it's pretty much all over Instagram. It's a project where you do something creative for 100 days around the hashtag you've chosen. Um, well, that's my understanding of it. Mine was 100 days of art which means every day for 100 days I've done an art journal page. And I'm almost finished. I'm up to day 90-something, so we're getting there. I'll be finished in a few days, so I'm very excited to have a complete art journal. So I've just started by um, putting some um, uh, book page paper onto my um, page. I didn't want a full page of it. I just wanted a bit of it. This is all. All I ever do is just throw paint around, experiment, play. I don't have any clue where I'm going with a page most of the time when I start. I just, most of the time I just want to play with paint or ink or just make a mess. As you can see, I use my hands. Very rarely do I use a brush. People always ask me why I'm so dirty. It's very, very rare that I paint with a paintbrush. Uh, this is my favorite gesso, Liquitex gesso. Now, I didn't think it really mattered. You know, gesso is gesso. No, how wrong I was. I don't like shiny, slimy gesso. I like um, gesso with a bit of grit to it, especially because I find that if you're trying to do things on top of it, the gesso I've had in the past was too shiny and it just didn't take and it it messed with my colours and that was the cheapy brand that I got. I spent the extra money, got some um, good quality gesso and I'm in love. I use this on everything, so I'm definitely going to have to stock up on the Liquitex brand. It's, it's my favourite gesso there is, so... I use that a lot now. It just permanently sits on my desk. My new uh, love that I've discovered as well is the Faber-Castell Pit um, Big Brush Pit Markers. They're a lot of fun to play with. So I'm using it instead of an ink pad just to ink up my stamp. Now these are permanent India ink, but if you move quick enough you can actually get an image transfer as you can see. And <clears throat> yeah, it's they're a lot of fun. I don't, I haven't really played with them a lot, but this was just after I bought them, so I wanted to test them out. That's what I do a lot in my art journal. I test out new products and, um, yeah, have a play. Uh, what I'm, I'm, I tend to focus on um, a focal image as well. Once I've done my background, I like to have a focal image. Uh, in this case, I decide to use some of the words on the background. I have a bit of a whoopsie moment. It doesn't work quite the way I wanted, but that is the joy of art journaling. There is no wrong in art, as my um, art teacher once told me. So I sort of go with it. I um, I try to go around some of the words to, you know, make that what my page is all about. And then I think of getting a wet one to wipe off some of the paint to um, show the words beneath, but it didn't exactly work the way I wanted, so I made a mess. So, yeah, I just go with it. Like I said, there's no wrong in art, you know, you, you work with it. So, yeah, this is another page in my 100 day, uh, 100, yeah, 100 day project, art journal. So, I will definitely do a flip, um, a flip through when this journal is finished. I cannot wait, not long now. I think I finished on the 12th and today's the 6th. So, won't be long. So, I hope you've enjoyed the video. Thanks for watching. And if you have, I'd really appreciate a thumbs up and, um, Leave me a comment below. I do love hearing from you all and I love um, interacting with like-minded arty people. So if you're not a big fan of the art journal videos, um, by all means, go check out the rest of my channel. I do a bit of scrapbooking and pro project life as well. So there's plenty to see and to check out. So thanks for watching. I hope you've enjoyed the video and I'll see you real soon. Bye.